Hi, I'm Keeney from Acceleration. I'm happy to present our demo featuring Twitter and Facebook's API, which we use to map out the social chatter revolving around the 2014 Consumer Electronics Show using a variety of Power BI features. You can do this for any hashtag you like. For example, we chose the hashtag CES2014 and hashtag tech to give you an overview of the power Microsoft's BI provides. I want to first start by showing you how powerful this tool is by developing the relationship with Twitter's free API and the drag and drop options of Power BI. We're able to view all the tweets that mention either hashtag by location, time, and top mentions in a user-friendly manner. Using Power View, you can create relationships in a graphical manner so that your data is easier to digest, which is especially helpful when making important decisions. Let's get started by using the data we collected to display the total number of tweets mentioning the hashtags CES2014 and tech. In the design layout, you can select whatever information you deem relevant and then map it graphically. Here, I wanted to show the total number of tweets versus the user locations, so I checked both boxes and mapped it. We can compare the two hashtags on the map simply by checking the query name option. There's many different options you can choose from to view your data. It all just depends on what you're looking for. In this dashboard, I can highlight any location on the map or click on a particular hashtag to analyze the data. We can even take a deeper dive and view the frequency of tweets by time of day. You can also customize the look and feel of your dashboard by changing the colors or viewing the data for a specific region, among the other options that are available in PowerView. In this example, we can see that the Twitter hashtag CES2014 is popular not only in just the United States and Europe, but also throughout the world. You can imagine how powerful this tool can be for companies that want to easily gather data on social media about their product or brand from different regions and cultures. Now let's take a look at the top Twitter mentions for these hashtags. Another cool feature of Power BI is the ability to drill down into the data to find the top influencers on Twitter that use either hashtag. You can take a look at who's using hashtag CES2014 the most, what they're saying, and when they're saying it. This dashboard can also be helpful for brands that want to measure their Twitter campaign performance against their expected goals. Here on the Twitter details dashboard, you can view the number of tweets and retweets that mention our hashtags by day, time, and user. You can even look at the most popular time of day the hashtag was used, morning, afternoon, or evening. This can be helpful for deciding when branded tweets should go out to followers. Using PowerView, we can look at real-time data from Twitter and Facebook and manipulate it into an easily viewable dashboard. Lastly, let's take a short look at the GeoMap tool. This is a nice feature that allows you to view your data on a world globe. It's just another cool way that Power BI lets you view your data graphically. Using Power Query, we can establish a direct connection with Facebook's API and gather real-time data from all across Facebook. This powerful tool lets us generate different tables based on the data we would like to analyze. Let's take a look at the same hashtags we've been using hashtag CES2014, and hashtag tech. Looking at the CES2014 hashtag, we can show the links, photos, statuses, and videos that revolved around the show. We can also break it down even further to view engagement by a specific gender and their social interactions. Companies can use this to see if their content is working or needs improvement based on their target demographics Facebook engagement. Thanks for watching our Power BI demo. If you have any questions, please feel free to email Acceleration at info at acceleration.com.